Hi, my name is Katie Bryan. I'm a freshman nursing major and I'm from Huntsville, Alabama. I chose the W because I felt like I was family on this campus and that I could just walk around and know people. Being able to know my teachers on a, on a first name basis, being able to have help from them whenever I want and just come to the office and act like friends and not like they're some, just some teacher. Um, I like walking around campus and being able to know a lot of people. I like how everyone treats you the same and everyone accepts you for no matter who you are. Well, my scholarship means everything because with my Heron scholarship I get to help people who need my help not just because I need it for my scholarship because I like doing it too. It means that I can grow and what I couldn't do at other colleges. Giving back to MUW is so important because we can allow future students to grow and to fly and to achieve their best. Hi, my name is Jatoria Jones and I'm a sophomore. I am a nursing major and my hometown is Greenville, Mississippi. I love MUW basically because it's a smaller university and it is filled with tradition and that is something that I really am used to. From my high school it was all about tradition, it was small and very cultured and I feel like it's a family here. So that's why I love MUW. My career, um, I am going to do the ASN program and then I'm going to upgrade to be a SIN to become an RN and I would like to be a nurse administrator so I can be over nursing but first of all I want to become an RN so I can learn all the techniques that I need to prepare myself to become a nurse administrator. My scholarship means that I'm one step closer to pursuing my dream. I would like to become a nurse and actually help people who are sick and who actually need attention. And um, I'm just used to being a helping person and caring. And I feel like the donors who lend out scholarships to us, it just they sacrifice for us so we should come back and sacrifice for them. And it makes me want to become an alumni and give back just like they gave to me very important. I feel like that's the, the top important thing once you graduate. That's what you should do. You should give back because somebody gave to you initially. So that's why you should give back. That's important. Well, my name is Brandy Winstead. I'm from Flowood, Mississippi and I am a senior nursing BSN major. I'm a member of the Mansdale Social Club and also of the Blacklist Honorary Social Club and a okay. member of Student Nurses Association. I'll be graduating in May 2012. I came to the W first off because I was interested in the nursing program, but after I came here on Scholars Day, I realized that it was a really special place and I felt like I could make a home here and I have over the past four years that I've been here and I really enjoy it. I love it because it's a small college and so I feel like I know everybody or at least know who everyone is so I can walk down the sidewalk and see a familiar face and have dinner in the calf with my friends and it's a real tight-knit community here. My scholarship is very important to me. In these times, it's hard to get an education paid for and everybody needs one to get a job. I feel like it made my success a lot easier and I can definitely say that I've benefited since in May I'll be joining the workforce and being able to give back eventually to help another student. Well, first of all, I'd like to say thank you and it's just so wonderful that they care enough to spend their time and money on students and help them get to where they are today. My name is Stephanie Camp. I'm from West Point, Mississippi, and I am a pre-nursing major. I'm involved in the Ina E. Gordy Honors College here, and I'm a W rep, and I am studying nursing. I want to ultimately, when I'm done with my first four years, I want to come back and get my, um, my nurse practitioner and um, my master's in nursing, and after, I want, because I like to work with people and a lot of people are seeing nurse practitioners rather than doctors now and I think that would give me a good opportunity to be able to help people. I love <clears throat> that it's a small campus. You know everybody. Your teachers know your name. You're, like They know who you are. They know what you expect from you. You have a rapport with them. They're all really friendly. Everybody here knows your name. You know. Everybody's really nice. You walk by and your arms are done at the end of the day because you've been waving so much. So, you know, it's just a really good place to be. Lots of friendly people. My scholarship means that I was actually able to come here. If it weren't for my scholarship, I wouldn't have been able to come here most likely. I probably would have gone to a community college. Um, I have two younger sisters and a younger brother and, you know, 
the cost of tuition is just a really big financial burden to place on my parents and have three other kids. So it, it means that I'm able to come here and go to this school, be a part of a great nursing program, have all these friends, and be at the school I ultimately want to be at. If people didn't give back to the school, then I wouldn't be able to come here. And I think that with this school, I will be able to do so much more than I would if I went somewhere else. There will be so many people who, because of people giving, will be able to go out and do amazing things that they may not have been able to do otherwise. My name is Sarah Shambly. I'm from Fulton, Mississippi, and I'm a nursing major. Well, I came to the Hearing Leadership Conference when I was a senior in high school and I just completely fell in love with everything about the W, all the people, the history of the campus, and I knew I wanted to come here then. And when I was a senior in high school, I didn't have, um, I didn't get enough scholarship money to come here originally, even though I really, really wanted to come here, because um, I had an older brother who was a junior at Ole Miss at the time, and I, had a young, I have a younger brother who's only a year behind me, um, who is currently at Mississippi College right now. And so, if I didn't have the scholarship, it would have just put um, it would have made it a lot harder for me to come here and for me to really enjoy what all the campus has to offer and it also would have been a lot more financial stress on my parents. So I'm really thankful that, um, that they don't have all that extra stress to worry about. Hey, my name is Jeanette Haresh and I am from Columbus, Mississippi. I am a freshman here at MEW and my major is speech language pathology. Uh, my scholarship is very important to me. Without it, I would probably be very stressed about college because I wouldn't have, I would be worrying about what to pay for and all of that, but instead I can focus on my school knowing that everything is covered and everything's paid for. I love the W because the campus is beautiful, the teachers are wonderful, they genuinely care about your education, and there are so many activities to be involved in, it is lovely. My scholarship means a lot to me, um, it's very important to me but also to my family because Without the scholarship, I probably wouldn't be here today. Hey, my name is Megan Searcy. I'm from West Point, Mississippi, and I chose the W because it is a smaller campus. I feel like I know a lot of people here, and I have some friends who are already going to come here too, so it made it even better. And I like the smaller classrooms. I'm heavily involved in choir. I'm in all the choirs here, and um, I will be performing in April solo for a spring recital because I still keep a voice lesson. The scholarship is important because any little bit of money helps. Like even if you don't have a full ride, you know, any money that anybody's willing to, no to notice to give you is good enough. I'm going to say thank you so much for thinking of me or thinking of anybody else who deserves this money and thanks for noticing all the hard work we put in. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for making my education possible.